As a medical doctor, I solemnly promise that I will, to the best of my ability, serve humanity caring for the sick. The need for the next generation of physicians is urgent, but even though Canadian and U.S. medical schools are attempting to increase enrollment, they are still at capacity levels. As a result, thousands of qualified applicants are being turned away each year. The solution to this challenge is here at the University of Medicine and Health Sciences, UMHS, where a new class of medical students is welcomed with a white coat ceremony three times a year. I'm just so excited I can't even describe it, really. The words can't even come out, <laughs> really. This is one of the greatest weeks of my entire life. And today, precisely today, is one of the most memorable moments of my entire life. Wearing a white coat is very important to me because it's a symbol of being able to give back to those in need, be able to help our community, um, as well as a reminder to work really hard in school. I don't feel like I'm another number. I feel like I'm a person. Um, you know, uh, professors recognize my name, and I'm just like, it's only the first week. Like, how'd you even know me? I have known other graduates from here as well who did very well and it's primarily because of the support they provide you here. This small family community here is key in helping you get through. And uh, I think for Canadians it's important to realize that the options are out there and UMHS is definitely a great one. The University of Medicine and Health Sciences, modeled after U.S. and Canadian medical schools, UMHS offers a comprehensive program for becoming a physician now. The traditional medical school curriculum, cutting edge medical education technology, highly qualified and credentialed faculty recruited primarily from the United States, personalized education with a small student to faculty ratio, affiliations with over 20 teaching hospitals where students are fully prepared and qualified to sit for licensing examinations with sufficient financial aid to cover the full cost of attendance for those that qualify. Uh, we really care about our students and every student that enters into our program we want them to realize their potential and succeed and become a doctor. We want them to live their dream. We want them to achieve it. Guiding UMHS is President Warren Ross. With a lifetime of experience, he is recognized and respected for his many contributions to academic medicine. President Ross is committed to providing students at UMHS an education equal to that offered by U.S. medical schools. We care about our students. We do everything possible to ensure that the students will be successful when they attend our institution. This is achieved by creating a state-of-the-art campus comparable to the best medical schools in the United States with outstanding faculty dedicated to your success and an impressively low attrition rate. Unlike other offshore schools that have attrition rates that exceed 20%, UMHS has an amazing attrition rate of 4%. As a result, the vast majority of our students will graduate and go on to become practicing physicians. Our Academic Advising Office provides guidance to our Canadian students in preparing for both the U.S. National Resident Matching Program, NRMP, and Canadian Resident Matching Service, known as CARMS. Extensive preparation for Canadian licensing examinations, as well as USMLE Step 1 and 2 through Kaplan Medical, ensures exceptional results. In the winter of 2016, students achieved a 93% pass rate on USMLE Step 1 with an average score of 220. With outcomes like this, our graduates have been very successful in obtaining residencies not only in the United States but in Canada and are represented in virtually every discipline. Canadian students are eligible for licensure and residencies in both Canada and the United States. I think UMHS prepared us very well for our board exams on both sides of the border. Uh, we both rotated in Canada, we did our psychiatry rotation there, and we fit in, slotted in perfectly. UMHS students can complete their core clinical rotations at approximately 20 affiliated teaching hospitals in the U.S., Puerto Rico, and Canada. Hundreds of hospitals are available for fourth-year electives. 
I actually did a, third, a fourth year elective in internal medicine um, down at Sunnybrook Hospital in Toronto and that was uh, really, really helpful to, to get an idea of what the system is like. I have personally had attending physicians from many U.S. colleges, uh, many U.S. medical establishments tell me that our students are absolutely the equivalent, if not better, than those from the U.S. medical schools. My dream is to be a physician, and UMHS really just made those dreams possible. They opened the doors to things that would not have been possible, you know, in the U.S. UMHS is the school for the student who does not want to get lost in the crowd. We will help guide you to achieve your dream. I felt the professors knew you by first name, they really cared, um, and uh, that made it, uh, the education, even more, uh, you know, exciting and to learn. At the state-of-the-art campus on St. Kitts, through clinical rotations in the United States, Canada, and Puerto Rico, students are part of an educational community dedicated to their success. Unlike other schools in the Caribbean, the cost of education at UMHS is affordable. Canadian students that qualify are eligible for as much as a $250,000 Canadian line of credit to cover educational and living expenses. We had a great basic science experience on the island. We had great teachers, great clinical educators, great experience, and we went on to do fantastic rotation. I'm from Ontario, Canada. Uh, I chose UMHS because of the small class sizes and um, how accessible the professors are. Um, you can get help at any moment. I want to thank UMHS. All the professors, all the clinical preceptors, all the staff um, at UMHS who made me fulfill my dream and I, here I am today as a doctor. If you want to be a doctor, why wait? UMHS can help you get there. <laughs>